How could I not play this adventure game? I mean, come on now. We got steamed hams. Mmm, yes, steamed hams. The graphic adventure. Riveting. <laughs> above average. Mmm. Truly a standard deviation above the mean. <laughs> Good old Seymour Skinner. Can I... Can I pull my chair? No. Oh. Can I look at the chair? Riveting. Can I open the door? I mean, I know what I have to do. Yeah, I'm right where I want to be. <laughs> okay. Well, Seymour, I made it, despite your directions. Ah, Superintendent Chalmers. Welcome. I hope you're prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Seymour, why am I here? <laughs> oh, no! Yeah, that's no help. There's a snowman in there. Yeah, that's no help. Can I pick up the snowman? I mean, in a other game that would work. I mean, yeah, that's no help. This literally is just taking us through Steam Tams. This is a point-and-click adventure game, which is still amazing. You can turn the faucet on. I'm just gonna leave it on. I'm, I'm gonna. We gotta go to the oven here. Oh, you gods! My roast is ruined. Oh no! Still My ruined. Roast is ruined. But what if I were to disguise someone else's cooking? But what if... I love, you can pick all these other choices, and he's just like, Bleh. Uh. Bleh. Uh. Uh. uh Bleh. I were to purchase fast food and disguise it as my own cooking. <laughs> Delightfully devilish. Delightfully devilish, Seymour. <laughs> okay, I have a cat that has decided... The second that I I started to play this is let's walk up here and be a problem. <laughs> Skinner with his real reputation. Seymour! Superintendent, I was just... <laughs> Uh, well, of course, the correct answer is just stretching my calves on the windowsill, but let's say a well, lie. Uh, uh, stretching my calves on the windowsill. Isometric exercise. Care to join me? Why is there smoke coming out of your oven, Seymour? Uh, <laughs> it's steam. It's not smoke. It's steam from the steamed clams, but I burnt the roast. My oven is on fire. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, that isn't smoke. It's steam. Steamed from the steamed clams we're having. Mmm. Mm, steamed, steamed clams. clams. Can I go back out and bother him? I want to do it wrong. Hello, I'm Principal Skinner. <clears throat> uh, hello, I'm, uh... I'm... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hope you're prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. I hope you're prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. Yeah. No. Yeah. I seem to have soiled myself. I seem to have soiled myself. Yeah. No. Can I look at Chalmers? Superintendent Chalmers. <laughs> like how he's, it's a shocked verge. Superintendent Chalmers, what are you doing in my, in my house, even though I have invited you here? Let's sneak out. Later that day. Ooh, we have Krusty Burger. Watering hamburgers. That's right, mouth-watering hamburgers. And our water is still... Let's ruin them. Oh, that's okay, we can't. <clears throat> so let's put the hamburgers with the table, uh, on the table. There we go. Superintendent, I hope you're ready for mouth-watering hamburgers. I thought we were having steamed clams. I thought we were having steamed clams. So we have spam, lamb, yams, and ham, but it's nope. It is not that. It uh, is not. Uh, uh, it is no, steamed no, hams. Said steamed hams. That's what I call hamburgers. You call hamburgers steamed hams? Yes. It's a regional dialect. Uh huh. Uh, what region? Oh, it's upstate New York. <laughs> Can you repeat the uh, question? Uh, Midwest Missouri, downstate uh, Illinois, or. Uh, Upstate, Upstate New, New York. York. Really? 
He's from Utica. Well, I'm from Utica, and I've never heard anyone use the phrase steamed ham. <laughs> it's more of an uh, it's more of an Albany. It's an Albany expression. I see. You know, these hamburgers are quite similar to the ones they have at Krusty Burger. Oh, no. Patented Skinner Burgers. Old family recipe. For steamed hams. Yes. Yes, and you call them steamed hams despite the fact they are obviously grilled. You, uh, you know, the one thing I should... I just, uh, uh, <laughs> of course. Oh, it is an inferno. Wonderful. Good time was had by all. I'm pooped. Yes, I should be. Good Lord, what is happening in there? Oh, it's Arroyo Borealis. I think the fire from the oven has spread. We are in danger. Uh, That's what you should be saying. Uh, Aurora Borealis? Uh, Aurora Borealis. At this time of year, at this time of day, in this part of the country, <laughs> localized entirely <laughs> within your kitchen. Yes. May I see it? No. <laughs> no. No, no, mother. It's just, it's just the northern lights. Well, Seymour, you are an odd fellow, but I must say, you steam a good hand. Help! Help! Oh, no. <laughs> so, but there's the thumbs up. <laughs> we played the meme. I'm very excited about this. Very well done. Great, great anim. I mean, wow. Super, super cool. I, I was fun. I mean, yeah, it was seven minutes, but wow, what a lot of effort went into that. <clears throat> well done, folks. So this has been Chris from The Gaming Corner, and if you have never watched the episode 22 short films about Springfield, you need to be watching it. It's one of the best pieces of animation slash storytelling ever put together on, on the media format. So thank you. Thank you very much for watching, and I hope you've enjoyed, and once again, thank you for the support that we've been getting. I appreciate you all. Bye.